Alright, darling, just hold still. Here we go. You look so much better than you did before. <laughs> I'm glad to hear it. In fact, you've been so well that you're being released today. No way, you're kidding. No joke, all your injuries have healed and you've been good for the past day. So I've already called your father and he's on his way. Oh, that's so amazing. Thank you. Of course, dear. <laughs> well, somebody looks remarkably better. Dad! Sissy's better! Yay, can we go home now? Boys, how about you all go wait in the lobby? Yeah, fine. Okay. <sighs> well, I'll leave you two alone. Please meet me at my front desk so we can fill out the paperwork whenever you're ready. Well, how do you feel? I feel great knowing that I get to go home. I'm glad that you're doing great, darling, and that you get to go home, but that's not the only thing the nurse talked to me about on the phone. What else then? Well, she reminded me that crickets aren't allowed in the hospital. How did Tofu get in the hospital? Um... Um, Mason brought her in. Mason was here, but he didn't have a cricket. He went home and got her and brought her back. After hours, I heartily believe that. The nurses certainly wouldn't allow him. I don't- I don't remember, okay? Well, if that's true, wasn't Tofu with you the night of the incident? I- I think so. I don't- I don't know. Then how did Mason get Tofu in the first place? I don't- I don't know, Dad. Did he do this to you? What? No, that's- that's crazy, Dad. Seriously? It makes sense, Ellie. How did he get Tofu when you had him the night you were hurt? Dad, trust me, he did not do this to me. And why do you think that? Because we're dating. Well, that makes sense on why he kept wanting to see you last night. I figured. What, so does that mean I can rule him out as a suspect? Dad, he would never do anything to hurt me, I swear. Okay, I believe you. Let's just go home. I'm sure the boys are making a mess in the lobby. Do you believe me? Let's just go home, honey. Speaking of home, I actually don't want to go. Why not? I really want to go to school. I'm behind. I want to see my friends. And Mason, I presume. And Mason. Fine. I'll drop you off and take Tofu home. Okay. Okay. Come on, Tofu. to Angel in private. Oh, sure. Come on, Jessica. Uh oh, coming. Baby, hi. How are you? Baby, what, what's the matter? Angel, how do I say this? We're through. What? Why? We're just not meant for each other. Baby, please, I need you. And trust me, you'll find somebody better. <laughs> There's nobody better. <laughs> Who who are you sneaking around with? Well, you know that Kali you manipulated? Ellie? Oh my dog, she's dating Mason. How not, Ellie? What? The, the who? What do you want? The Kali you manipulated is Leo. Remember when you paid him to attempt to rape Ellie? Oh please, he wanted to. No, he didn't. You paid him to cheat on Ellie with your little minion, Jessica, then rape her at Mason's party, which he didn't because he's a good person. And you're far from it because you are the one who poisoned the drinks. So what, you're gay now? I'm bi, thank you for noticing. Have a good life, Angel. A good, manipulative, naive life. Come on, babe. I, I, what happened? Yeah, girl, what happened? I just got dumped. Wait, are you serious? And I think I know whose fault it is. Honestly, I don't think it's anybody's fault. He's had feelings for Leo for a very long time. You knew about this? Yeah, it was pretty obvious. Do you agree? Huh? <sighs> Never mind. 
it, it isn't the same without her here. I know, it really isn't. There's not much we can do about it though until she gets better. Actually, the only thing we can do is figure out what the fuck to do about this angel situation. Babe, we don't even have any evidence that she did it. She hates her gut. She has motive. But that's just it. No solid evidence. Why are you getting so defensive? I'm not. I'm just stating facts. All right, lovebirds, break it up. It's just, it's just not fair. I know, it's not. We need to come up with a plan on what to do. You mean figuring out what to do with the angel? Yeah, that's exactly what I mean. All of us need to get together, like last night at the hospital. Us, Mason, Scott. Where's Sky? He's over there with his friends. That's Ava? What the hell is she doing with Sky? Hey, Sky. Hey guys, what's up? What? Did you just kiss Ava? Uh, yeah, that's my girlfriend. Dude, I thought your girlfriend was somebody else. Nope, but isn't she hot? Um, no. Why are you dating Ava? Ellie hates her. I didn't think I had to get Ellie's approval to date somebody. You don't. Ava's just not a good person. She is to me, and unless you guys have some sort of evidence, I'm not breaking up with her. <sighs> Whatever. Anyways, we're meeting at my house today after school. We need to talk about Angel and what she's doing. Well, I don't think it's Angel. What? What? Ava said that Angel was with her last night. Okay, so Ava's a part of this too. No, that gives Angel an alibi. Okay, seriously? Angel is definitely a part of this one way or another. Ava could be a part of it too. No way, you all don't even know Ava. Dude, seriously, it doesn't matter. She's with Angel. And Angel hates Ellie's guts. So it's settled. Ava's a part of it. Whatever you guys say, I don't think she's a part of it. You all can keep making your false conclusions. I'm out of here. Dude, wait. What? Let's just talk about this more at Anna's house today, okay? Fine. I'll be there. That's the bell. We should get going. I'll tell Mason whenever I see him. I'll have him in English later. I'll tell him then. All right, well, see you guys later then. Babe, wait up. Alright babe, I'll see you later. Bye baby! Alright gentlemen, now that he's gone, I can give you this. Oh damn, yeah, no, right? You'll have more where that's coming from if you follow through with the plan. Deal. Now, get out of my face. Hey. Let's talk. About? About the plan. Specifically this phase. Oh, you mean your plan. What are you talking about? See, I have my own plan in action. And I mean, you can follow along too if you want. Because essentially it's the same thing as your plan, but better. What do you have in mind? Well, you said there's a death, right? I just want that face to come a little quicker. Uh, no, the key for, uh, Ellie is to get depressed. Um, and not kill her. <sighs> Please, it's not a real death, but good idea though. In all honesty, why not just kill Ellie? Because I want her to suffer, not die. Well, clearly we have different intentions. I want Mason, and if I can't have him, nobody can. And by the deems of it, I'm not gonna get him anytime soon with Ellie in the way. You're not killing Ellie. It will ruin the plan. Too bad, so sad. Speaking of which, Parker broke up with me this morning. Okay, and go cry about it? Why do I have reasonable suspicion that it was all up to you? <laughs> I don't give a shit about your ugly boyfriend, okay? Him breaking up with you was not my fault. What? Angel, come on, we gotta get to biology. <sighs> Fine. See you later, beep the itch. Come on. Okay. All right, honey, I signed you in the office. I'll see you after school, all right? Oh, but before you leave, um, do you have my glasses? I don't have my contacts in. Yeah, I do, actually. <sighs> Thanks, Dad. I haven't worn these here in forever. Whoa. I'll see you later, honey, all right? Come on, boys. Let's go home. This is the big kid school. Come on. Okay. <sighs> Maybe I might regret wearing these here. 
I'm gonna go get my books. Ellie? Mason? Hey. Uh, whoa, I didn't know you wore glasses. I, uh, I don't know what you're talking about. Ellie, I can see the glasses on your face. I, uh, I don't have my contacts in. Uh, I see that, but it's okay, Ellie. It doesn't bother me any. It doesn't? No, why would it bother me? I, I, I don't know. N never mind, I guess. I, I don't... Uh, sorry. It's okay, I just didn't expect it. That's understandable. Oh, hey, one second, my phone's beeping. It's alright. Note from Emma. Emma, really? I didn't know you had her phone number. <laughs> I do, she gave me it last night at the hospital. We're trying to figure out who did this to you and why, so apparently we're meeting at Emma's house today after school. Oh, okay, um, I'll be there too then. Great, I'll see you then. Actually, you'll see me in English soon. <laughs> and at lunch. Hey, still, I'll see you then. <sighs> Ellie. Hey. Hey, Parker. I was just about to head to biology. What's up? We need to talk about something important. Okay, what is... Ugh, Leo, what do you want? Leo's with me. Relax. Face it, Leo, we're never getting back together. I'm with Mason now. Well, congrats, but that's not the reason why we're here. Ellie, we need to talk to you about something important. I know, your little girlfriends, Angel and Jessica, already tried to poison me last night at the hospital. Angel isn't my problem anymore, and Jessica isn't his problem anymore. And they definitely shouldn't be yours either. They're in fact the least of your worries. What do you mean? Ava. Oh yeah, I already know. Ava was already with Angel and Jessica last night at the hospital and were gonna poison me. However, Eliza was there and she was feeling doubtful. Ellie. What? The only people you should worry about in that group is Ava. Angel is the least of your worries. Ava is a nightmare. How so besides all that? You don't know, do you? No, what? We need to meet after school. Can we take a rain check? I actually have to be somewhere after school. Ellie, this is pretty urgent. Guys, I know, but seriously, I are you free right now? I, I guess I just signed in to school. Okay, that works. Yeah, we can go right now. Go where? Let's go to my car, come on. I guess we're going to his house. I, I, what? Come on. Hey Lexi, where's Ellie? Hmm? Oh, um, in the hospital, remember? No, she, uh, just got back this morning. I saw her this morning at school. Oh, um, I haven't seen her. I didn't know she was back. She could just be late again. Just wait. Yeah, maybe you're right. All right, class, please open up your textbooks and let's start reading about our literature section. So... Leah wasn't here. Holy crap, I just now realized that. Do you think he has something to do with Ellie not being here? It wouldn't surprise me. Here, let me text Emma to see if Ellie showed up for biology. And it's not a male private part, so you will please stop saying it is. She said Ellie didn't show up to biology. Are you sure she was here today? I'm certain we kissed. Does she know we're meeting after school today? Yeah, yes, I told her. Nathan. Okay, then she'll Is show up then, or no, she'll okay. show up at lunch. Nathan. Yeah, you're right. He's not a duck. He is an okay. actual person. Want anything to drink? Uh, sure. Okay. Hey, babe, can you give me some juices? Babe? You sure, babe? What do you want? I'll just take a root beer. What about you, Ellie? Uh, orange juice? Okay, so Parker doesn't have orange juice, so I'm getting you lime because he's lame. How am I lame? You literally drank it all. Hey, I didn't drink it all, okay? There you go, babe. Ellie? Um, thanks. So, let's talk. Yeah, let's talk. Hey, babe, do you got another chair? The rocking chair's in the living room. Ugh, but I don't like that chair. Babe, come on. <sighs> I'm sorry about that. He could be very... <laughs> I'm short. What, you're short in height or short in dick? Shut up! 
Anyways, let's talk about Ava. Agreed. So, Ava. She has a plan against Angel. Obviously, you know already that Angel has a plan to poison you. But, you know, she also had a plan to, um, how do we say it? Oh, um, I think she had a plan to make her, like, depressed or something. Yeah, like, suffer. Yeah, so she made you want to suffer by losing your friends, losing Mason, losing your cricket. Her intentions weren't to kill you, but they were to make you suffer. But she's the least of your worries. So what are my worries now? Well, I said Ava. Right, Ava is, will you stop rocking? You made me get the rocking chair, so I'm rocking. I will peg you, stop. Okay, okay. In other words, Ava has a plan up against Angel in order to hurt you physically. It originally was an Angel's plan, however, it is now Ava's plan to kill you. So, we need to come up with a plan to make sure that doesn't happen. Right, because Ellie, I know we've had our differences, but trust me, Angel paid me to try and rape you, was that it? Yeah. She also paid me to cheat on you with Jessica because, well, my family was going through a rough time. I needed the financial stability, so forgive me if you want, but I just want you to know the truth. Leo, you're forgiven. I'm so sorry. It's cool. Trust me. In the hallway earlier today at school, I overheard Ava talking to some guys about hurting you. This is not when my concern immediately sparked interest, but this was when I knew I had to do something right away. Which is why we're here. Yes, so we need to call your friends up and devise a plan to make sure that doesn't happen. She plans to do it in the next few days at the winter formal dance. The winter formal dance? I thought it was a ball. It's a dance, not a ball. But anyways, yeah. Okay, well, I guess I can call Mason and my friends up today and they can come over. Give them a call right now. But they're in class, more than likely. It's 12.30, right? You know, so they're probably at lunch. Just give them a call. Call whoever you want first. Okay. They're on speaker. Ooh, interesting. Stop rocking. Fight me. Lexi, hey. Oh my gosh, hey girl, where are you? Are you okay? I'm okay, but uh, right now I'm at Parker's house and we're talking about that plan that we wanted to devise earlier, later at uh, Emma's house. Yeah, what about it? Well, instead of coming to Emma's house later today, can we all meet at Parker's house? I don't see why not. What's the address? 122 Meadow Lane. Okay, sure. See you then. All right, thanks, Lexi, and be sure to tell Mason. Uh, yeah, I plan on it, and tell okay, everybody else. Okay, bye, girl. Bye. Now we play the waiting game. <sighs> Babe, share. The fridge is literally behind you. Um, yeah, but I'm in the chair now. So, no. <sighs> Dude, that's mine. You can share. Ellie. Mason. <laughs> Aw, why can't you be like that? I am. You just don't like it. Not when you suffocate me. I don't suffocate you. <laughs> you came in quite early. Yeah, I skipped my last class. What? Why? As soon as Lexi gave us the news, I ran over here. They're on their way to here, by the way. You all skipped class for this? Yeah, but when do I not? Well, for you, it's not surprising, but for them, yeah, it is a little bit. Oh good, they're all on their way. Oh, yay. I regret giving you the rocking chair. Hey, we're here. Ellie! Oh, you're wearing your glasses. <laughs> yeah, I didn't have my contacts. Ellie! Hi, Lexi. <laughs> hey, we're so happy you all can make it. Yeah, thanks. Can I have a sip of your root beer again? No. <sighs> Look, you all are here to discuss the issues of Ava and her evil plan to kill Ellie. Yeah, we concluded this morning that Ava is working with Angel. As I told Ellie, Angel, so least of your words, and you need to focus on Ava. Ava wants to murder Ellie. Oh, dog, you can't be serious. Why are you helping us, specifically Ellie? Didn't Leo try to rape her? Long story short, I got paid to do it and attempt it. I wasn't actually going to do it. In fact, I'm gay and I'm bi. Well, that's a shocker. It is, but we need to devise a plan to help Ellie. 
Okay, then how about this? We take Ava out. Dude, I'm not killing anybody. No, I don't mean kill. I mean knock out. Yeah, but she's gonna try this at a winter formal dance. So let's try to be less violent or we're all gonna go to jail. Winter formal? Yeah, the dance is this weekend. I don't know why there. She just wants to. But that's apparently the only shot we have. Okay, then what? The knocking out idea sounds like a good idea. Yeah, could work. What do you mean? We knock her out, put her in Parker's car, and we'll take her here. Try to figure out why she's doing this. Compromise with her. You think compromising with her is going to work? It'll have to. We'll have her in our control. It definitely gives us an advantage. Right. Okay, so who's going to knock her out? I will. I'm the one she wants. That's correct. She doesn't want to harm Mason in any way. Yeah, so she'll least expect it. Ellie can definitely distract her in some way. It doesn't have to be Ellie that distract her, it can be anybody. Cause we knock her out, we put her in Parker's car, take her to Parker's house, and boom, we got her. So that's the plan, huh? I guess it is. Great. The winter formal is this Saturday. Everybody be on your game. If you have any questions, communicate. And I believe we're done here. I believe so too. All right, good then, let's go home. Come on, babe. Okay. See you later. Come on, Lexi. Coming. Bye, guys. Hmm, that was easy. Hey, Mason, I don't have a ride to get home. Can you take me home? Sure. Come on, babe. Thank you guys so much for what you're doing. And I'm very sorry, Leo. Don't be sorry, Ellie. It was my fault. Okay. Can I have a sip of your ruby? I said no. Yeah. Uh-oh. Hey, Dad. Oh, hey, honey. I, you're home from school early. With guess. I know it's unexpected, but he drove me home. I really didn't feel good. Oh, it's all right, honey. Thank you. Uh... Mason? You're welcome, sir. Well, I'm glad you're home early anyways. The boys are down for a nap, so I'm gonna go ahead and head to work. Get some extra hours in, get some extra money. That's all right, Dad. Go on ahead. Okay, well, you will be good. I'll see you all, well, Ellie, tonight. Sounds good, Dad. Bye, honey. <sighs> Come on. This is my room. Whoa. Uh, don't pretend like you haven't been here before. Cause uh, I forgot I have. <laughs> well, just make yourself at home, I guess. I'm gonna go put my contacts in. Hey, did the power go out? The lights are off. Are you on my bed? <sighs> I guess you're tired. Good night, I guess, but it's only, like, what, for almost four o'clock? So, how's the party? Well, you know, it's pretty fun, especially when you're here. <laughs> you're never this sweet, ever. What, I'm not allowed to be? Not when somebody has a plot to kill me. I have to get your mind off it somehow, I guess. Come on, dance with me. <laughs> okay. What? Should we alert them? Probably. Mason is signing us. Interesting. Should we wait? Yeah, she hasn't done anything yet. Okay. I was signaled to wait. Okay. 
Hello, darling. Welcome to the wonderful mobile. Would you like a boat? Um, no. Well, unfortunately, boats are required at this dance, so I mean, look, hag, I don't want a bow. Young lady, if you're gonna have an attitude like that, I'm gonna have- to I'm not even gonna be here for long, so pipe it. Jessica. Yeah? Have you seen Angel anywhere? <sighs> Don't talk to Ava, Jessica. It's not worth it. What? Why? It's none of your business. That's why. I think it's all my business. Now, get out of my way. My pleasure. Thank you. What's her problem? Honestly, I have no idea. Hmm. Ava's here. Him in. Yeah. She's here. Okay. Let's start. Hmm. Cool party. You ready to go on with my side of the plan? You know, I don't know if I want to go with your plan. What do you mean? I mean, my plan sounds way better. Um, no it doesn't. Mine does. Yours is going to get the wrong person killed. And yours is just adding gasoline to the fire. Face it, mine's more effective. I don't think it was a good idea. Okay, just go along with my plan. You know what, how about you do your own plan and I'll do mine. Attention. I'm going. The king and queens of the winter formal bowl will be announced in two minutes. Will all contestants please report to the front? All right, ladies and gents, this is the moment we've been waiting for. So the king of the winter formal is... Castiel Jack! Congratulations! Open the back. Where did you go? Looking for me? This room is perfect for a makeout sesh. <laughs> Why did you poison Ellie? Clearly I wasn't successful, but that wasn't my full dungeon. You need to leave. Mason, honey. Ava, what the hell? Mason, if I can't have you, nobody can. You're fucking crazy. No, Mason. I think you're crazy. Take him. Let go of me. This is only gonna sting. Oh, sharpening the arm. What, you really think I'm gonna kill you? There we go. Not gonna lie, your blood smells weird. Take him, boys. It's my house. Let go of me. <laughs> and the winter formal queen is... <laughs> oh dear. I'm sorry. I tried to save him, but it, it, it didn't work. You shot my boyfriend? How could you? I didn't do anything. I found him. But you nasty mongrel did it. Excuse me? I've been out here this entire time. Yeah, whatever. I saw you. Believe me, everybody. She shot Mason. I don't believe that for a second. Ellie was with me. And with me. And with us. So, what you're saying is, it was a team effort. Oh, give it a rest, Ava. You did this. I didn't have such thing. I just found the body. Is that so? Yes. I don't believe it. But it's true. Wait. Mason! Oh yeah, go run the little old Mason. That is enough. I'm calling the police in an ambulance. He's already dead, that's not necessary. Oh, you're just saying that not to get caught. Shut up. I can't believe you'd kill him in your own blood. Baby, come on, it wasn't me. I'm not your baby anymore. I haven't been your baby since what you did to Ellie. Which was? You and Angel tried to poison her. 
I didn't know such thing. You have no proof. At least my proof. You failed to keep her in the hospital, so you did this stunt. Nice try, but you're going to jail for a long time. No. Uh, yes. Sorry, babe. It's okay. Babe? Ew. Oh, and you're homophobic. Nice. Oh, to hell with you all. <gasps> Look out! Let's get out of here. What about Mason? 911's on their way. You're right, we need to exit the building. <sighs> Come on. I... You're in a lot of trouble. I... <sighs> Let's go help with Ellie. <sighs> Neva! <sighs> it's okay. It's okay. Mason! Mason! You're not getting away this easy, Ellie. <laughs> what did you do? How the tail are you still alive? <laughs> Call me invincible, I guess. <laughs> Ellie! What did you do? <laughs> Something I had to do. <laughs> <laughs>